In order to be authentic, you need to be vulnerable. That's probably scary for a lot of you. I know it can be scary for me at times, but it doesn't really have to be if you think about it. But before we dive into that today, click the subscribe button so that you can keep up with the content that we're posting to support you as a transformational leader. To be an authentic leader in business, you do need to be vulnerable. If you listen to what Brene Brown has to say, she says, vulnerability is the courage to show up authentically regardless of the outcome. That doesn't mean weakness, it just means showing up. It also doesn't mean showing up and yelling really loudly either. It just means showing up and being willing to open up and be genuine with people. Every time I do an Accelerated Leadership Program, I show Brene Brown's video, The Power of Vulnerability. If you haven't watched it, I encourage you to. It's really, really fascinating. At the end of the video, people have a sense of what it really means to show up regardless of the outcome and to know that they're unique and it's, it what, it's what makes them unique and special that is so powerful in showing up authentically and being vulnerable. But the reaction I get so many times is, well, that's great. I can do that in my personal life, but I can't do that in business. So I ask them, do you know anyone? Do you know anyone in business, either in our company or outside of our company, that you believe is a leader that shows up authentically? Of course, without exception, they always come up with names. One of the names that came up at our company was Tom Rothman. He was one of our chairman at Fox. The thing about Tom was he was, he was intense, he was passionate, but he was also vulnerable and available. You knew where he stood on things, he was open and real and honest with you, and you knew where you stood with him. And because you knew where you stood with him, it was, a, it was a, an exchange that sort of happened where you felt connected to him. If I'm vulnerable with you and you're vulnerable with me, our connection is going to get deeper. We're gonna develop a higher level of trust and respect, and that trust and respect that we have with each other will develop into loyalty. There's a lot of stickiness and retention that's built around being vulnerable and connected to people. I have an expression that we use at our company all the time. We are better together than we are alone. That just doesn't mean being physically present. It means being connected and developing that trust and respect. Vulnerability is an incredibly powerful tool. I use it all the time. I suggest that you Take a deeper look and see how you can use it more effectively too. That's it for today. Don't forget to click on our newsletter and get more content from us on developing tomorrow's leaders today. Take care.